Tori and welcome back to my channel. Um, so today we're going to make a lip gloss and we're going to make my cherry lip gloss. And you see my table already clean, set up. I wiped it down and I used these bags that I used from the Dollar Tree that I bought the wrong size for. But it's good for cleanup, girl. You just wrap everything up, put it in the trash bag, open one, put it all in your bag, wipe down your table and you're good to go. What I did for this one, so it won't be as long, I went on and pre um, set my tubes. So what I'm doing is half of my cherry um, tubes will already put the glitter in. And the glitter that I use is from Beauty Trend. Yep, make sure they're cosmetic safe um, for your skin. You don't wanna put regular fine glitter. And I would use the clear wand tubes. You see, I rinsed it out, but by the time I get to it, it have been a dry it out. I have it on my table under a light fan. 91% alcohol. I just like to spray my gloves once I didn't touch tubes and do all of that before I get started because it's just another cleansing way, as you can see. And so let me go. This is just my bow I use with a plastic spoon. I use two spoons because I measure out with one and then stir with one. This is the flavor we're using today. Um, I'm using strawberry kiwi with my um because I use cherry with a different type, but I wanted to try that one out since I haven't used that yet. You see my um syringes. I have two here just in case I have to switch out. And then I have my oils and my versa gel. So let's get right onto this video. We're gonna waste no time. So let's start with the um, Versa Gel, and this is from TKB Trading. Like I said, I have a vendor now that I'm gonna be going through to get my um, kits because I'm gonna put kits together. And what you're gonna get is the Versa Gel. You're gonna get my special tea oils mixed all together in one. You will get some tubes. Um, I'm gonna do black wand tubes. Um, and I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have black and pink and i'm gonna do squeeze tubes as well and you can get it labeled and all of that good stuff so yeah i just kind of wanted to let you guys know because people always ask me girl do you wholesale yes i will be wholesaling it's because my oils are so amazing like i said they're not only softening your skin but they help maintain your pink pretty lips which is amazing I use, just starting off, I'll put three. And this is my specialty oil. Like I said, I make natural oils. I have a beauty business where I make soaps, lotions, creams. Um, For a long time, I had was breaking out for a lot of the stuff that they use in the store. So I started making my own and doing more of a natural. So I have lotions. And this is... um coconut oil I add extra with my oils and then I'm just going to do three just like I did three teaspoons and this is a good base to start and you just stir in slowly um I like to use the teaspoon so I can kind of measure how much I'm using and a lot of people don't measure but it's always good to have measurements of what you're using so that way you'll know I, this is about a half a bag of Versagil and then you know how many it can make. That way you can know how much your cost of every, you need to know the cost of every lip gloss you make. So you can know if you're making a profit, <laughs> have a degree in it and can tell you marketing and strategies on how to work your business. Cause you don't want to just sell lip gloss and don't make a profit. You want to make a profit, but you also want to give people quality. So quality people, I will pay for quality, right? Yeah. So. Okay, you see this? Okay, keep stirring a little bit more and I'm gonna add in a little more. So then that way you know how much to buy versus how much you use. So yes, measure everything you need to know those. You need to know when you go into getting these big businesses, you see how they go like on shop tech and things. They wanna know how much it costs to make that item and how much you, um, you can get that cost down so they can make money. You see that? So kind of look around and figure that out. So that's why it's a good thing to measure. All right, so this is about the perfect consistency I like. See that? We're ready to get rolling. Wanna put 
little on there. You don't want to go a whole lot. So I'll start with about that much. Ooh, that's pretty too. Okay, Cherry. Just stare that on it. Oh, that's gorgeous, you guys. Look at that red. See it close. Woo! Pretty. That. Yeah. And it has like these gorgeous tones in it. Oh, this is fire. Yes. I right, stirred in some more. What you do is add four drops, four to five drops of my strawberry kiwi. And I just use the pipe bag, get some up, and just drop four to five. One, two, three, four, five. I think that might have been six, but you don't want to overdo it. And it's, oh, this smells good too, you guys. This is cherry and cherry sparkle. We have cherry and cherry sparkle. So, all right, let's go ahead and fill the syringe because we are ready to fill the containers. And then you get your pipe back and you just secure it. You could tape it down. Some people do. I don't think we need to. And because I'm going to fill the clear ones, what I do is because it has glitter, I usually fill the clear containers first. Push it on in. Make sure your tube is down in there. Yes. And you push it on in. So that way you start to fill it, you see that? And you get mostly control of it. Then once you do it, you grab it, and then you fill it side to side. And this is how I fill my tubes. Fill, fill, fill. All the way to here. Yes. Then you do the rest. Mm -hmm. This is the best part, you guys. It's so rewarding to just fill the tubes up. Take your time and just fill it up. My favorite parts are my wand tubes. I love these tubes. It's my favorite. And you don't want to go too far. Right there. You stop it. Because you don't want to. Um, you want to be able to put your stopper in. So don't go too far up. And then we're done all the plain tubes. You see that? All right, and just take the tops, wipe them off. That's why I have my alcohol there. Put the tubes aside. All right, here's the one tubes, my tubes are everything, right? You guys, you guys love this, right? This year, we're going to get into a lot. And this thing has to pop. I hate that. Guy. You know, they make it secure, so. Which is amazing. Here we go. Ooh. All right, so those are done. Put those to the side there. And now we're going to just fill our glitter tubes. So let's start here and then, yeah. And then you can see me fill these side to side. And this is just like so enjoying. You see that? Pow. Ooh, that is pretty, you guys. See, all of these is unique because I put the um, Cosmetic Safe glitter inside the tube. And then, yeah, so it makes it unique to each one. The Cherry Kiss and Cherry Kiss Sparkles, which are gorgeous. Go. Just lay them all there. And I got one more to fill these last three. Right. 
So I had to go um get some more tubes because look how much gloss I have left. Some left. I see that pretty color. So that's what it looks like. Yay! All right, you guys. So here's the wand tubes and the squeeze tubes and the sample tubes. If you guys enjoyed this video, check out the website. Purchase you some at www.toriesbeautyworld.com. And make sure you like, subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.